Kate Middleton has banned Meghan Markle from Prince Philip's funeral. Meghan Markle has not traveled to England with Prince Harry for Prince Philip's funeral. One report says she's been banned from the service by Kate Middleton. Gates Revenge Meghan banned. The cover story of In Touch says Meghan Markle's presence at Prince Philip's funeral would have made it awful. Prince Harry has already touched down in England for the first time in over a year, which a source says is bad because he's already been dreading seeing everyone again. Markle is not by her husband's side because she's apparently been banned from the funeral. COVID-19 restricts the number of guests to 30. A source says, the last thing they want is more trouble at Prince Philip's funeral. So she's been snubbed. Kate Middleton personally ensured that Markle wouldn't be at the funeral, with an insider saying this must feel like the perfect revenge for Kate. Tensions haven't cooled between brothers either, with a source saying that Prince William would lock his brother in the Tower of London if he could. The Duke of Cambridge hopes to make Prince Harry see the damage he's caused without Markle, there to interfere and stir up trouble. The story concludes with a source saying that Prince Harry fears that instead of this trip making things better, it's only going to get worse. Is Meghan Markle banned? Let's imagine for a second that this story is true. With all the fire the royal family has come under over its treatment of Meghan Markle, would it really be a good idea to ban her from a funeral out of vengeance? Why would Prince Harry, who loves his wife and left England to raise a family with her, attend a funeral that she's been banned from? Furthermore. Are we to believe that Kate Middleton is relishing in the death of Prince Philip? The story makes it sound like she's chomping at the bit to hurt Markle and this was the perfect revenge. Gossip cop also flat out doesn't believe that Prince William would want to see his brother locked in the infamous Tower of London. Just because there's tension doesn't mean he wants to see his brother presumably tortured and hung like it's 1605. The real reason is obvious, with a baby due early this summer. Meghan Markle is currently in the third trimester of her pregnancy. A palace spokesperson told People, a far more reputable outlet than the tabloid in question, that Markle has been advised by her physician not to travel. The source added, Meghan expressed condolences. The Queen understands why she can't travel at the moment. There are no hard feelings over missing this funeral. But that won't stop this tabloid from trying to profit off the death of Prince Philip. The cover is inflammatory, saying Prince Harry was in tears because he never got to say goodbye. This isn't news, it's vulturous behavior from a trashy rag. Other hateful stories In Touch regularly publishes bogus stories about Markle. It claimed that she was throwing a lavish birthday party during the lockdown. But that simply never happened. Its cover story about Middleton and Markle being simultaneously pregnant was completely false as well. It also said Markle was grooming Archie for reality TV, but Markle's made it clear that there won't ever be cameras in her home. The magazine also once claimed that Markle had walked out on Prince Harry, but they're still together. This tabloid knows nothing at all about the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and it relished the chance to use Prince Philip's death to sell magazines. This is a shameful story from a disgraceful outlet.